Hello everyone, Sarah here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today, we're going to talk about why your car exhaust manifold is leaking oil. Here's what causes it and how to resolve the issue. Blown Head Gasket a blown head gasket may cause your car's exhaust manifold to indirectly leak oil as it forces the oil to be expelled through the exhaust manifold. The engine head gasket helps to keep car fluids and gases separate. If it blows, the coolant and oil can mix or enter the combustion chamber, causing the oil to be expelled via the exhaust manifold once burnt. This would result in white smoke coming from the exhaust. You should have your gaskets inspected by a professional for signs of wear or damage. If a blown gasket is the cause of the exhaust manifold leak, replacing it will fix the issue. Faulty or bad piston ring A faulty or bad piston ring can allow oil to leak into the combustion chamber and get expelled through the exhaust manifold. A piston ring helps to seal the engine's combustion chamber, prevent coolant and oil from leaking into the chamber, and ensure consistency of the pressure of the gases. Damaged or worn-out piston rings may result in coolant and oil leaking into the combustion chamber, resulting in a burnt oil smell or blue smoke from the exhaust manifold. Inspect the piston rings for possible damage or wear and tear. If damaged or worn out, replace them. Malfunctioning Turbocharger A malfunctioning turbocharger is also a potential cause of the exhaust manifold leaking oil. A turbocharger improves power output. If malfunctioning or worn out, it compromises the vehicle's functioning, causing engine oil to come out through the exhaust manifold accompanied by excess fuel consumption, a check engine light, and sluggish acceleration. Have your turbocharger inspected by a professional and repaired or replaced if it's malfunctioning or damaged. Here's how to diagnose the issue. You can diagnose your exhaust manifold oil leak by conducting a leak down test. Follow these steps to conduct the test. Turn off your engine and wait for it to cool down. Detach the spark plugs from all the cylinders. To test a cylinder, set its piston to the top dead center, or TDC. Connect a leak down tester to the cylinder's spark plug hole. Apply compressed air to the tester. Carefully listen for hissing sounds and observe the tester's pressure gauge. A hissing sound is a sign of air leakage. Listen for possible leaks at the intake, crankcase, or exhaust and compare the pressure readings. Repeat this process for each of the other cylinders. Consider your results for any differences in the leakage percentage. The source of the issue is where the air is escaping from. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Till next time.